What's up, it's Jared from Vandalistica Vlogs, and today I'm shooting everything today on this guy. I don't even know if you can see. There you go. Anyway, uh, I'm going to film this at 1080p on 24 frames per second with Rocksteady on. Rocksteady being um, the motion in the ocean explosion. Um, and I'm going to go to the hardware store and get a replacement part for my scooter. No, hardware store probably doesn't seem like the right place to go for it. <laughs> Electric scooter repair, but we're going to bubble that shit and see if we can get away with it without killing ourselves. Alright, so um, this is the problem here. This bolt goes into a tube that goes right through to the other side here and at some point that has sheared off. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to, I've already ordered a part through, a, I've got a new scooter guy that lives, uh, sorry that works pretty close to me, he actually lives pretty close to me too, I found out yesterday. He's ordering me the real part but just so that I don't, you know, pass away on the way to work or riding the trails or whatever I'm going to get a bolt uh, long enough to fit through that so we're going to quickly take some measurements um, and go from there so there's the part in question it is basically just a tube so there there's the broken bolt and there's uh, the opposite bolt the uh, giant hex head now so I'm gonna get these dimensions and then I'm gonna to go to the hardware store and uh, find something that works so we're at Bunnings now let's just see if they've got this thing on <coughs> one thing I didn't think of is the fact that um, the pipe that I had, that I measured to 150 something. Um, I'm just going to do the COVID check in. Uh, I've got to account for the fact that that pipe doesn't sit uh, flush in the recess in the swing arm, so I have to get it bigger so I may end up having to go like 180 millimeters but anyway we'll figure it out that didn't take long at all we've got uh, 12 mil uh, by I went for 200 because it's gonna be a little bit longer I think that should make it that should work but I doubt that they're gonna let me take it out of the store and, <laughs> and go see if it fits but I mean it's like 20 bucks or something so if it doesn't fit fuck I'll just get another one I'll keep my receipt but so nut bolt washer I need some permatex because even though this is not permanent I don't want it falling out <laughs> really well I've got bolt nut two washers I actually had to go back into the store to get the washer because I didn't think about the fact, it probably needs one on either side because I'm pretty sure originally the one that's in there now had one on either side. So I got that and some Loctite, oh, thread locker. Blue though because I want to put the actual part on when it gets here. <laughs> yeah, I don't want to be having to take a blowtorch to things to try and get it off. Um, yeah, but it's, I don't know, it's maybe like 8.30 or something. Oh, how about 9.16? So it's 916. I still haven't had any food or coffee or anything. So I'm gonna go find a place to get some sustenance. I haven't got our bolt home yet, but I'm still gonna call it a win so far. Um ended up at Steel Grind Coffee and Crepes, um, which is down this little alleyway here. Um which is really cool. I've never been here before. I keep seeing the sign but couldn't figure out where it was and then just couldn't be bothered. You know, back in the days when I was catching public transport and stuff. 
Um, yeah, so I got a toasted sandwich, a nice coffee, some sparkling water because I'm a fancy pants. And uh, I don't know if you can tell, I've, I've changed, uh, like I dropped the exposure a little bit just to get, like the sky's always blown out in these videos. But um, I think you can tell from that that she's not looking good. So I'm glad that I got this hardware sorted. I can get home and do this fix and then, uh, I don't know, maybe just play some Call of Duty. Oh, edit this video, obviously. All right, I just recorded this whole thing, but I'm an idiot and didn't check that it was actually recording. So I, I turned the camera on, but I didn't actually record. Right, short, long story short, I've got the bolt and I'm here home. Um, getting ready to take this out and put in the DIY bolt. We'll see how that goes. What I didn't say that, uh, I was going to do, I didn't know I was going to do it, to be honest, I just kind of decided on the fly. Um, I'm going to try and paint a graffiti piece. Uh, let's just leave it at that, okay? Um, we've got a bunch of different caps for different flows. We've got a black. We've got a white. This is a Groundhog's Day, to be honest, I just did this. <laughs> We've got a uh, like a turquoise robin's egg aqua kind of color aqua aqua um, and then a hotish pink. So um, I'm looking forward to giving that a go. But let's get this bolt out, put the DIY one in, see how she feels. I might even just take it out the street for a uh, for a test drive ride test ride drive all right that seems appropriate first thing to do is get the existing bolt out and I actually did this uh, I started doing it a little bit up in front of the store with this bolt so I'm gonna take the weight off actually get these cans out here. I'm really excited to try that paint I think it's gonna be fun so I'm gonna jam this in here Hopefully that's in shot. Yes, it is. I'm gonna take the weight off here and I'm gonna jam this in and see if we can't tap out the old box. Oh, that's right, I forgot I taped it in. That's why that's not coming up. Still buying the replacement, the proper replacement part. But this is just for a little bit of peace of mind because I'm still gonna ride this guy to work. There we go. He's out. Take the weight off. There's the old bolt out. Now, we've got, oh, that's not very stable. We've got in here, in here being my bag, which is just off to the side, Loctite, blue, and a couple of washers. Now, hopefully this is not a problem and these washers fit. Do you know what? They bloody well don't. Damn it. Okay, not a problem. I will use the real. There was one washer on this existing bolt, and we'll use that copper washer. I'm very surprised. Oh man, it's only by a fraction. What is that? Two millimeter? Damn it. One and a half millimeter? Alright, so anyway, we've got our. DIY bolt. I'm gonna slide that through. And she comes through. Uh, hold on, let's get in here. Can't see. Oh, here we go. And she comes through. All right. She comes. She comes out quite a bit there, actually, if you can see that. Now I'm gonna put this copper washer in here. Just at least it's got a washer on it. And then I'm gonna hit this boy with some thread locker. Let's shake him up a little bit, make sure get those juices going. Ah, that's right, I do need to clip the end of that. So multi-tool is in the bag always. I used to always have uh, this multi-tool in my bag. Uh, I don't know, just as a ready for anything kind of thing. But to be honest, more often than not, it's me doing Bubbered scooter repairs. It's 
put that back on there so it doesn't drip everywhere. And we get our bolt. Uh, sorry, a nut. Get that nut down in there. That's starting to touch that red locker. And look, that's bobbered as all hell. No one's, uh, no one's gonna uh, say any different. But what it is, is a good kind of, uh, what do you call, stop gap measure. I don't know how much these were, but obviously, um, not enough for me to really care about it. And to be honest, I'm so bad with money, they probably, they could have cost a lot and I still wouldn't have cared. But, that's nice and on there. And I'm not riding again today. Uh, well, at least probably not. But, uh, that's in there. That is actually, that doesn't clear the, uh, frame here. So that's not a concern. Then on this side, that's well tucked inside there. So, um, pretty good, pretty good. I really overestimated how much space I would need there, um, but that's okay, better safe than sorry. Just cause there's a little bit sticking out there. Um, you know, whatever. Um, so thread lockers on there, and obviously you wanna let that go for, you know, an hour or whatever to, here and seize up, but um, hopefully, feels nice and solid. <laughs> uh, yeah, hopefully that'll do us until the part arrives. But anyway, this has been me riding around town, buying things, committing to a life of crime, perhaps. <laughs> but God bless. Look after each other, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye. That was a big one.